Hey, I was on here. Just got done watching the final season of Castlevania. It was sort of a good, say, Game of Thrones like of ending, but but it wasn't rushed like like it was like the like the like the Game of Thrones series was. It was sort of a good ending with everyone that survived the bad final battle. It was a strange ride, but it was indeed good. But the question is, with Netflix planning spin-offs of Castlevania, which one should they do? And what Castlevania leave is gonna and what Castlevania left is gonna be big shoes to fill. Well the best that I can say is start with the laments of the with the laments of innocence story arc. Since that's where it all started. But then... Other uh, than Simon, then Richter... And then maybe a decent attempt of... Maybe an actual attempt on adaptation of Decent Symphony of the Night. But what about the... Games that I set after Symphony of the Night. Well, well, the the one that seemed to be good enough is the Sorrow story arc. Are of Sorrow and Dawn of Sorrow. That's um, where it, where it all ends. But don't know what it'd be like in between the in between those. With the dragon of cycle of death and resurrection. But then, that's it. Don't know if they'll take Lord of Shadows into consideration. Add a CG series, maybe. Can't guarantee it. Anyway. Before I say over and out, let me ask you one thing. What if Dracula's resurrection is through technology?